little project today taking this plastic tart i'm going to convert it into a container for me to transport fully capped frames of honey so you're probably wondering why do i want to build this little frame in this in this tart to transport my my frames my honey frames from my supers why can't i just transport them straight in the super um, I had a look at uh, guys that are transporting in the supers and, and it makes a terrible mess. So I've only got a few supers right now um, and I don't want to, to have that uh, mess and that honey dripping in my vehicles. I have closed vehicles um, and then also I'm taking it to an extractor so I might not be able to take the honey from the super straight to the uh, extraction. I may have to have it sit for a little bit here at home uh, to get the date that where I can get it into the um, electric extractor at uh, another beekeeper's location. So this will seal off, the bees won't be able to get in here. I'll be able to keep the frames nicely apart and not scraping up against each other. So that's the plan. So I wanted them nicely spaced, as you can see over here, we're gonna, we're gonna go with six, and then six on top of that, so there's gonna be 12 in a box. Okay, so we've got the four ends, I've notched them out. That's where the frames are gonna sit in. And then I've got uh, six of these strips, which we're gonna join up to form like a, an outside frame for the frames to sit on. And then that'll slot into the plastic box. So I'll put the brandering on each side, two on the bottom, two on each side, so it's nice and sturdy. I've made them a little bit loose, just uh, so that they're easy to get in and out, but they're nicely spaced out. Um, and I think that they probably won't bump together, especially once I've got the nine frames 
in the 10 frame box of the spacers so that the comb will be thicker in each of these frames. And then this little case now will fit into the plastic tart. <clears throat> so the job's done. We built two of these frames. The honey frames are going to go in there. They're nicely spaced, so if the comb is nice and thick on the, on the frames, they're not going to touch. And then um, in the type, we can put two of these. I can store it like that, put the lid on, and then I can transport it. And um, uh, it's going to basically keep my car clean so that I don't have any honey dripping anywhere. It'll be easy to carry into the, the place where I'm going to go and do the extraction job done um, yeah if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more little ideas and tips and tricks then uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, smash the like button if you enjoyed this one thanks for watching